Stunting is another part of cheerleading, probably the fans' favorite part of cheerleading. It's the most exciting, they're getting tossed up in the air, and at the same time, the moms of the flyers are cringing because they hope the bases catch them. We're gonna teach you the safe way to stunt so you can really wow your audiences, but they can trust you that you're doing it safely. I first have to mention about stunting. There are rules um, for high school level cheerleading um, that there has to be mats. It would be a blue foam cheer mat before you can stunt. Mostly, the cheerleaders will put the mats down when they're working in a gymnasium. Not only is this a standard for high school sports, but it's also a highly, highly, highly recommended safety precaution. You're putting these girls up in the air, and human error is possible. It does happen where people can fall, and that's a reality, but it can be done safely, and if you take the necessary precautions, add extra spotters, have mats, if you can do all of these things, and you can really have some very cool stunts the safe way. Um, that being said, I'm going to teach a couple basic stunts that if you have never had stunt experience, you can do this um, without fear of anything going wrong, and you can really impress your audience. So this is probably the most novice stunt we're going to teach. It's called a thigh stand. Um, the girls are going, okay, but first let me explain the uh, roles within a stunt. These are your bases. Raise your hands. They're going to be holding the flyer in the air. This is our flyer. Most of the time, the flyer will be smaller than the bases. And our back spot, which is normally the tallest girl, um, so she can really reach up there and support her flyer, um, is going to catch the arms of her flyer. So the bases, if you want to step forward. For a thigh stand, um, the prep, they're going to lunge, do a right and a left lunge, and their knees are going to meet and their feet are going to meet right in the center. So this is going to be a really stable base for the flyer to stand on. Next, the flyer is going to prep by putting her dominant leg onto the um, base, the base's thigh. She, if you notice her grip, she's gripping behind the leg and her foot to really support the flyer. We're going to do this with counts like we do everything. So we're just going to count one, two, and the whole group is going to work together. She's going to dip and stand up on the other base's leg. The back spot in this role is really guiding her up there and ensuring that she's safe from the back side. It is up to the flyer to stand up straight because there's nobody there in front of her. So she's got to really feel a line pulling all the way through the center. And so she's kind of holding her weight so the weight isn't all on the bases. And she's also very stable up in the air. So we're going to count. We're going to do the stunt. One, two, down, up. And when your flyer gets up to the air, you want a huge smile and a nice strong high V or whatever motion, if they have a sign or pom-poms, whatever it is they want, you really want them to, that's where they're looking at this point. And to come down safely from this stunt, the bases are gonna grab hands with the flyer and they're gonna count again, one, two, and she's gonna pop off to the front. The back spot, her hands never left the flyer's hips. She's supporting her the whole time and guiding her down. All right, girls, let's just go through the whole stunt together without me walking you through it. So the bases in the back spot are really going to count um, together to make everything in sync. One, two. One, 